Okay, here we go. As I was devour, we have 35 cards. After 10 turns, we would have drawn 14 cards on average and lost 20. So we've got to kind of win by 10, 10, 11, 12. It's not easy. And we have to keep the Cthulhu in our starting hand somehow. I think backpack's really good because at least we get an extra two cards salvaged. Right. Okay. Let's see how it goes. It's a bit... Could be easy, could snowball it, or it could be really hard and just end up in fatigue. I mean, we are priests, so generally we do have that ability to heal up a bit better than other classes. Um, I'm going to go really think carefully. Right, Persian Madness, not important. So the word pain, that's a, that's a good. Um, the Onyx Bishops are quite good. Hmm. Injured blade must be very nice to to mill. Uh, ah, so we've got portable forge. We really need portable forge. That's a really strong card. Um, Potion madness, underwhelming, underwhelming. Um, got to get on the board to make use of that. I'm going all out for the Cthulhu. Ah, we got it. That's good. Okay, so that's guaranteed 12 damage. Every time we play a Cthulhu card. Okay, that's, that's good, I suppose. More battle cry. Okay, that's okay. Perfect. <clears throat> right, let's see, I mean, five health to enemy hero. Yeah. Okay, okay, fine. Okay, it's a good card. So we've got some good late cards. That's good to see. Mind Blast. Okay, we've got him too, which is good. That also gives us an extra card. Good. We want to burn all the weak cards. We want our... Ah, perfect. That's what we wanted. And we really want Woe Cleaver. Oh! Alanus! Oh my goodness. Now I've got to really think about this one. Okay, let's have a look. If I'm drawing six cards each turn, that means I'm going to be fatiguing in another three turns. But I will salvage a lot of my cards. But my cards are too high health, that's a problem. Uh, too high mana. We have to go for the Woe Cleaver, or maybe Valinir. Valinir could work. Um, buff up what I do have. Things which die, and if something dies with a Kel'Thuz add on the board, then I get the battle, I get the death rattle, goes back to something else here. This is not easy. Um, Alaness, I think it's going to put me in fatigue way too much. I mean, can I win in six goes? I don't have the mana, that's the problem. If I had the mana to play these high cost cards, I would do it, but. I 
I think Woke Cleaver is better. Um, okay, I'm going to lose a couple of Battle Cry minions. Let the Bishop the Herald. There, yeah, the Kassoon cards as well. Well, Valonir, give him minion in your hands 4 2. As that goes to the Kassoon, that's an extra 8 damage. Because I'm going to get a 4 plus 4. The death rattle and then you have a couple ones. So I play around my Cthulhu and hope I draw the Cthulhu cards as opposed to. It's going to get. The work clear is going to get me an extra three cards and I just have to hope that I draw the Cthulhu cards as opposed to. By the light! Um, Oh, nice. Okay, that's good. Right, I really do, don't want the zombie child to be good. Good. Okay, that's good. Oh, you must be joking. Uh, battle cry. By the light. See what we get here. Little bishop. What's died so far? I can't really play the bishop, it's just I haven't got enough value. Two zombie chose or more of a problem than anything else. I assume he's going to play this into that anyway. Oh dear, there goes my Kassoon card. Um, three and three. I'm going to resurrect. Do that. I'd rather than tomb something a bit better. I really want to get my Beckner of Evil next turn if I can. That's my Kassoon's only going to end up doing 12 damage. Maybe I wait. To play the Kelusad. Um, By the light. Let's see, let's see what happens here. Ah. Okay, that's not too bad. Let's just go face um, and hope he can't get an extra point of damage on here. I'll still leave it up there. Let's hope he doesn't have a board clear as well. Okay. Oh, how annoying. Hmm, can I do damage to him? Going to this checkmate. Destroy random enemy minion. Let's do this. Okay, it's 
not the one I wanted. Should I entomb this? Yeah, why not? Okay. Okay, good. Oh, you're joking. You're joking with me. Should have saved my tune for that. This is a Kalisad against this. Is my mind control gun? Oh no! Oh, interesting. Okay, is he gonna kill? Yeah, he's killing the. No, he's not. He's not killing it. Wow, that's interesting. Okay, this is interesting. Maybe put this up. Maybe put this up. Yeah, we'll ki we'll kill his three off. This is going to go down to two halves, which is enough to take out these two. Yeah, I, I do want to preserve this. Oh, one minute. I got the, the extra Kelsazad coming back. And I got my Kathun next turn. So let's hope that it doesn't do anything too scary. Here we go. Okay. That was interesting. I think we might win this now. Again. Okay. Uh, we'll kill this because it's going to come back to life. Kasun. And this. Oh, one minute. Do we miss lethal? <laughs> We miss lethal. Alright, never mind. Alright, that's good. Yay, we did it. Okay, that was scary, but we did it. And we'll finish off with the Cthulhu. Hey, we did it. Okay, easy on when we thought it got. It looked a bit scary, but yeah, that, that Cthulhu came in a bit useful at the end. Not major, but hey, fantastic! Nobody is walking away with cobalt treasures. Fantastic. Okay, thanks for watching, everyone. That was interesting. It took about four four times to try. Beating with priest, I found priest is really weak. You've got to know when to how to use those sort of um, sort of those turns where you what's the word the swing turns where you know you steal his minion or something like that. Yeah, I was just thinking that that the treasure which we were offered earlier uh, the last. The last time we were offered them, um, uh, we ended up taking what was it called? Um, we took the orb 
And then a little bit of destruction. What was it? The amulet of domination. Yeah, we took it. Usually you just take that earlier because you add minions to your dungeon that you could be doing that. But, I was just thinking, if we took the aleatoric cube, it says shuffle both decks together and give half to each player and your cards cost two less. That might have, that might have been absolutely perfect for Azari because um, once we run out of cards, we just play aleatoric cube and we mill half his deck and we replenish half our deck. Mm, fantastic. Uh, remember, shuffle both decks together. We don't have any decks, so basically, I'm stealing half of his deck. So that would have been interesting if I would have taken that one, but it's generally not such a good card. But yeah, I might bear that in mind for another time. Right. I mean, if I get another scroll, scroll of confusion and uh, a mask of mimicry or something really bad like that, and my third one is like an aleatoric cube. Maybe I'll take the cube then. Otherwise, not really worth it. Okay, uh, we're going to work out what we're going to be playing next. After Priest. or oh, Giant Rat. So what counters Giant Rat? Which class? Uh, um... um Let's go with Mage. Okay, so next time we're going to be playing Mage. Okay, I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.